Welcome on my YouTube channel. I have now here these two CD players and uh, I decided to make uh, this short video, not with CD, this CD players, but uh, uh, with the uh, manual, I can say, <coughs> how to choose not bad CD player. Because I receive every week question from my customers uh, or from my friends or from people uh, how shall we choose the right CD player or not bad CD player. Uh, I'm sure that uh, the audio experts, audio enthusiasts and uh, everybody who understands the CD players will not agree with me. Maybe they would like to kill me for this video. But uh, uh, let's uh, see and let's hear how we can choose or how I can choose a not bad CD player. Uh, the most important part of the CD player is the uh, DAC DAC uh, digital analog uh, converter. Where you change, where is changing or transferring or converting the digital signal to analog. Uh, this is something like uh, uh, the sound card in your computer. And uh, there are many, many, many types of such a converters. And there are thousands of types of CD players. So uh, it's not uh, too simple to uh, be common with, uh, with such a, such a uh, converters. So the most simple way is to find something with not bad converters Philips. Philips DAC TDA 1540-1541-1543. These converters are not bad and if you choose any CD player with such a type of converter and if it works <coughs> I can say you should be satisfied with the sound. <coughs> Some of all the types which have uh, I can say better one uh, TDA 141540 are pretty heavy not these types uh, something like uh, the CD pair, I think you cannot see it here. This is uh, Philips uh, 304. It has about 9, 10 kilograms. Uh, these uh, types, which are uh, lying here, standing here on the table, are not heavy. They have 4,4 kilograms, and they are newer ones from the year 1991. And both of them uh, have uh, the TDA 15. Four, three. But if they will work, the sound will not be bad. I'm using also uh, not only Philips. Uh, for uh, example, very good uh, converters from uh, Sony, but only any of only some of these types. And uh, it's as I told, uh, not not so simple. For example, I'm using the studio uh, CD player Sony CDP. 2700. I love it. I love this Sony uh, more than uh, the Philips. So I'm using usually the CDP 2700 from Sony. But for the choosing, for the simple choosing of uh, CD player, I will prefer that uh, you will look for the Philips TDA 1540 uh, I uh, placed uh, on my website uh, also the digital analog converter list where are hundreds, hundreds, maybe thousands of types of CD players with the uh, information which digital analog converters are inside. Uh, you can find it uh, in the on the page uh, technical uh, information manuals and etc etc. Uh, 
it's uh, here I can <laughs> I hope it will you can you can see it so it's starting lap Ebbingdon Akufes and we go on Aiva Akai Arkham Aristona and next and next and next this is still only A B Blaupunkt and so on so C Cambridge Audio and uh, <laughs> if I go to uh, Philips we can see what should be here there should be this uh, 1543 uh, uh, but it will then on it will take uh, a lot of time so I think there will be uh, more thousands of uh, CD, CD players so I will not uh, list uh, list here now everything uh, you can see it on my uh, on my website so now I will make videos with, with these two CD, CD players and uh, I hope that uh, this I can say short manual uh, will be helpful for for you if you are looking for some uh, some CD players. Uh, you can uh, certainly you can uh, read some uh, read uh, some discussions on audio forums and a uh, lot of types are used for tuning and so and so and so. But uh, this this way, uh, as I told here, is uh, I can say very very simple. And if you ask uh, why Philips. So the reason is also very simple, uh, because Philips uh, was one of the first companies, uh, together with Sony, uh, which started the production of CD players. So for uh, other companies uh, were uh, also simple to use uh, the uh, converters from, uh, from Philips. If you are collecting Grundix, you can choose the very very nice and very good uh, Grundig CD uh, 7500 or uh, not so nice but also very good uh, 7550. It's a pretty heavy and very very good uh, very good CD players. Uh, inside is uh, TDA 1540 or uh, somebody collects uh, Marantz. So from Marantz are uh, very good uh, CD CD player 74 or 84. I uh, 84 I had here, so you can find it in one old old video. I think it's also very nice nice device. Or somebody uh, collects or likes uh, Nakamichi, well known audio producer, uh, incredible expensive. So Nakamichi, Nakamichi uh, OMS7, so the top level, also uh, Philips TDA1540, uh, like, like the Marantz. So I think that it's, it's enough and the video will be too, too long. So thank you for your attention and I hope that it can be a little, little helpful. Thanks.